strong. But I'm extremely for that thing that's clear, everything is done. Why did you decide this morning to come have the vaccine? It's a very safe place uh -huh. and we need to be vaccinated to be safer with our families, with our friends. Fantastic. Earlier in the first wave we set up, uh, we set up in the Owino market and we vaccinated over 1,000 people and I'm glad now we are doing it in Chitintale, in the Nakawa and I think we need to go where the people are. That's what will really help with the creating the awareness and making it easy for people to access. My government pledged an additional £100 million worth of vaccines to be distributed to the uh, less developed countries, which includes Uganda, over the course of um, the next nine months. We'll meet that commitment. Currently, we are in uh, our phase three of the vac vaccination drive. We had one in March, April to May. Then we had one in August. And uh, we are in this phase which started on Monday <clears throat> with a target of vaccinating uh, 20,000 more additional people by uh, uh, Saturday this week. Just last week we had a campaign to vaccinate teachers and I must say that we're very happy because the response was very good and we vaccinated 11,013 teachers in that campaign.